Westminster Bridge, walking back over towards our hotel. There's Big Ben and stuff. London Tax is going. Let's see if any London buses will be coming up. Oh. There's our London Eye again. Well, we did. Just coming down here, we found this luggage shop. Let me zoom in on the luggage shop. Because I bought too many souvenirs and was starting to wonder. In fact, as Brian and I were walking up, we were wondering um, how we were going to pack and stuff. Because I was going to have like all kinds of carry on or I'd have to check something else extra. And I got a free caricature. Well, I found a. Um, they were having a half price sale, so I found a great seal large bag that I can fit everything in. I can check two bags and I'll have, you know, my little briefcase uh, on the plane because I can't, you can't check laptops. You have to carry laptops on. But, of course, well, of course a London bus, uh, one of the double-decker red ones won't come by when I'm videotaping. I took a pretty good picture of one a little bit ago. Brian, do you have anything to say? Uh, what did we I, do I today? Just got, I just got it. Well, just now I just got a free caricature that someone kicked on the sidewalk here. Yeah. So there was a two dollars, or I should say two pounds a piece. Okay. Got it folded up right here. Oh, cool. All right. You got that? No creases. Having a great time. Uh -huh. Eventually, we're going to head back to the hotel and have some munchies. Oh, that sounds good. Uh, right now we're just across some bridge going across the okay. Thames. Uh, Westminster Bridge. Westminster Bridge. Um, wh There's what, statues what, and monuments everywhere. What all did we do today? Where, where did we, we went go? down to Crystal Palace, saw where Bruce played last night. Talked to a couple friendly people down there. They're at the show. People taking apart the stage, working on the ground there. Yeah. And uh, then we got on the bus, or not, excuse me, the uh, train and headed up to Waterloo Station. Okay. Saw the Eurostar. What do you think of all the uh, information people and just people on the street being helpful to us? People are, are in a destination, they're in a hurry, you know. Right. But for the most part, the folks here are real friendly and very polite. Everybody we've talked to has Everybody been nice. we've met personally has been very enjoyable to talk to and very, very much interested in us and where we're from. And we, we met an old gentleman today in the Clapham Junction video or, uh, train station. As he's looking for help to get on his train, but we couldn't help him, but we told him that we were foreigners out of from the U.S. He goes, oh, God bless the USA. Thank you so much. That was, that was very uh, enlightening. Americans are very well liked over here. Because yeah, we're pretty much on the same page politically. And, uh, yeah. In fact, as soon as we open our mouths, a lot of the people know we're Americans. <laughs> and they just seem so eager to talk to us. And they'll say, you're from the States. Well, we talked to somebody about 9-11. Um, uh, yeah, and, his, this, and that young gentleman we met on the street right by Crystal Palace, and he was at both shows Monday and Tuesday night. All right. He had a ticket for Monday night show, and I believe he won a ticket for the Tuesday night show, so he was at both shows also. He had a young girl with him, his young daughter, so he had some kind of he was in a hurry to kind of get her back home, I think, out of the sun. But, uh, he stopped to talk to us for a while. He uh, had a lot of sympathies for the U.S. and the losses of 9-11, and he brought that up. And, Very nice conversation. There's a million London double decker red buses, and none of them. Oh, finally. Well, that's a new style one, but uh, we're going to give up on one of the old style ones now because it's time to get walking. And like wandering across 